Power, Happiness and Success family. This video is for anyone out there who really wants to start attracting greater positivity, who wants to make rapid progress in their lives. This video is certainly for you. So let's dive in. So in this video, I'm going to be referring to predominantly our unconscious. Okay, the really the thing out there that governs everything that's running the show because you're you're Conscious might be thinking, I want greater wealth, I want greater health, I want to be more positive, I want to be more loving, I want to have more energy. But your unconscious is really the one in control here, the puppet master, if you will. And it's the one that really overwhelms any random positive thoughts that you might have. And you can create a happy con unconscious. It's a choice. It's a program. And you can change this program. And it's all about being completely positive. Because, and you can tell whenever, if you have a, a, a negative unconscious, if, if you know you want to, to include a, a positive new habit, such as exercising, meditating, uh, reading something, you know, taking, partaking in, in a course, starting a new habit, you know, um, starting a business or, 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 or getting promoted or learning about a particular investment, whatever, if you know that there's something really positive that you want to incorporate, and whenever you think about doing these, these new habits and, and so on and so forth, it, the more resistance you experience when you're thinking about going to the gym, when you're thinking about meditating, when you're thinking about reading a book that you know you really should be reading to improve yourself dramatically, the more resistance you have to these activities that you know you want to do, the more your unconscious is set up to cause you stress, to keep you as you are, to keep you within fear. Because whenever you look to partake in a new activity, such as reading or going on a course or going on a workshop or developing your skills or traveling the, or going and working abroad in a new country or whatever it is that might be challenging, but exciting and really riveting, the more resistance you receive is because your unconscious has been programmed by you to push you away from these things. Because it wants to keep things the same. It wants to keep you within the familiar. And what I advocate for you, and apologize, apologies for this picture in advance. What I really advocate for you is the importance of living in the present future. I really need you focused here. And you know, I can give you a really good analogy of what I mean exactly in this instance. So what I mean by this is as follows. Most people, like say if you had to walk across, you know, they've got those, those wires or those, those small things where you have to walk across buildings or let's just say you have to walk from one cliff to another cliff and it's really terrified when you're looking down and you're scared of heights and those sort of things, right? So what most people do, and the reason why most people are fearful, uh, living by their ego, living with their egoic mind, being identified with their mind, their negativity, uh, absorbed with their reputation, how they're perceived, not feeling enough, these sort of things, that's what the ego is here. The, more, the problem is most people have taught themselves, their unconscious, to focus on fear, to be obsessed with their ego, and therefore to remain static, to make even no improvements in their lives at all. And a lot of people, sadly, can go through their entire lives without really changing and becoming a better quality person. I find that, that to me terrifies me, honestly. Like, I don't understand how people do this. And you know, you have millions of people experiencing life where they just stay within the familiar, they do the very basics, they don't challenge themselves, they don't grow, they don't experience life to the fullest. And what a shame that is. And it's because they're governed by their past. They're, they're, they're traumatized by their own past. And they're used to looking down. They're used to looking at what they're afraid of, what they don't want, and therefore they attract it. And when you and they teach you, experts will teach you when you're looking to, to go and do something scary like this, genuinely uh, petrifying, like walking across uh, cliffs or and so on and so forth, or walking across massive buildings and uh, with something small with little or no protection. Like the key is to focus on the present. That's how I see. It. Be in the moment. Focus on your breathing. Focus on the here and now. Focus on the things that you're grateful for. Focus on what you love about yourself, because the more you experience love, the more the closer you become to that greater source, that greater intelligence, uh, God, Allah, whomever it may be to you, that greater spirituality that you might have, whatever it is to you. The more you experience love, the more focused you are on the present moment, being in the here and now, fully present, 
Not focusing on, oh, what's this person thinking of me? Not being focused on, oh, I need to accomplish this and that, otherwise I'm not good enough. Oh, I can't believe uh, he or she rejected me. Oh, I hate myself. I, you know, I'm not good enough. I'm not attractive. I'm not this and that. Whenever you're going through these patterns, this is what you're doing. You're tripping yourself up. You are falling. Metaphorically, you are falling. And you need to stay in the present moment. And you need to oscillate. You need to jump between living in the present and being in the future. And, and by being in the future, I'm not talking about dwelling on the future, like, oh my God, how am I going to pay my bills and this sort of thing? Of course not. I'm here talking about visualizing and envisioning a more beautiful and prosperous future. Because your unconscious, when you vividly imagine things, when you vividly believe things and project a more beautiful future, you move towards it. You start to channel new energy within you. You start to change your chemistry. You create new neural networks, new patterns in your brain. You start stimulating neuroplasticity. Your unconscious can't tell the difference between what's uh, actually happening in front of you and what you vividly imagine. So what I'm saying is, your positivity, your visualization, thinking of a, a more beautiful, pleasant future is the only way to begin the process of changing this, of eradicating this. Because you're too focused on what you want. Focus is everything that we've got, guys. Focus is our energy. It's our attention. So most people have conditioned themselves, taught themselves, to put all their energy, their focus, into what they fear, what they don't want, their ego, obsessed with themselves, being narcissistic, being cynical, being negative, being judgmental, stereotyping others, and thus feeling stereotype. And instead, you need to focus on the present moment, you need to project the positive future so you can start to move towards it with conviction, with clarity, with con congruency. Because you need these things working together. The problem is, most people eliminate the present. And they're obsessed with the future and the past. They oscillate between these two. And when you oscillate between these two, your ego is in full swing. Your fear has been triggered. And when you're acting from here, you can't be synchronistic. You can't be cultivating and manifesting a beautiful momentum in your life. It's just the way life works. So if you appreciate this kind of content, you want to know more, head on over to my website at www.alexgem.com. Simply click where it says join PHS today. Enter your credit card details. You'll get instant access to my miraculous course. I must say, I'm so proud of it. It's amazing. One of my best works. Um, the power system. Taking you from wherever you are in your life. No matter what energy levels you've got. No matter what physical shape you're in. No matter what kind of health you're in. Great health or you're, or you're, or you're suffering some, from some kind of disease or, or ailment or impairment. Regardless of where your self-esteem is in life. Regardless of how financially wealthy you are. Or how abundant you feel. I'm here to take you to that next level. That question is, are you ready? Because I've also thrown in here free sensational bonuses. Hours of exclusive video footage, podcast material, a hundred audio segments to teach you how to balance your neurotransmitters, how to change your habits, how to stimulate neurogenesis and neuroplasticity, how to live it, how to change your habits, how to be focused on your goals, how to direct your energy, how people trip themselves up so you can stop making the same mistakes, why people procrastinate, how people procrastinate, what limiting beliefs are, examples of limiting beliefs, how to change them. How to take hold and control of your life. And how to maximise your potential. It's absolutely beautiful, this course. I'm not charging it anywhere near what I should be charging it for. Go check out the price for yourself. Check out the testimonials. Check out, when you click where it says join PHS today, scroll to the bottom of that page. And you'll actually see um, what, the, what the sections within the course comprises of. And you'll see segments within the course. And some of those are set to preview. So if you click on preview, you get the worksheets, the video, the audio, the written word, all for free for those particular segments. So you can try it before you buy, if you will. I offer a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no, there's no reason why you should not be taking action. And if you're not taking action, it's because this is what's happening to you right now. You're being fearful. You're being negative. I'm not charging a lot for this course, guys. I'm making it affordable for you. I want you to step up. Invest in me and invest in yourself so you can start to move towards what you want and what you desire. Like this video if you found it beneficial. If you're checking this out on um, YouTube, hit the subscribe button, but also click the notification bell because every single week I release new video content, new podcasts, new episodes that I don't release on any other social network. So you're going to want to subscribe. 
Have a great day. Look after yourself. Stay strong.